Well, hello, YouTubers. This is Best Lines MTB, Best Lines Mountain Bike, Best Lines MP MBT, M MBT, and just wanted to go over the ride that I had this morning. Made it to the trails, and uh, this thing, this this bike, the this is the uh, 2021 Stump Jumper Alloy. This is the lower uh, line of the of the Stump Jumpers, but. It took everything I, I I threw at it today. It was it was awesome. Uh, it took the it took the berms very well, uh, the the wet leaves, uh, any of the the things like I said the throw at, I threw at it. it the, the jumps did well. Lands were landings were firm. Uh, was not too bouncy. I have my rebound set pretty good. I might have to adjust that a little bit, but just wanted to to let you know that as well. Uh, let me know of any questions you have regarding riding and how it acts. Uh, I did notice a little bit on the the back brake. It doesn't lock up like I want it to. Uh, it it does does work properly, but sometimes you want to get it to lock up a little easier than that. But those aggressive tires, that uh, purgatory in the back, has just really aggressive. Uh, uh, is is really good for uh, gripping and and it does not have a problem with that. Also wanted to mention the butcher in the front. Uh, the turns didn't get much slide at all. Uh, it had rained uh, about two days ago, so the f the trails were all pretty nice and firm. So uh, it handled handled great. There was some gravel around the area, uh, and uh, you know this the, the, these tires just just grip everything, uh, depending on the speed that you're going. But uh, did work well. Didn't get too dirty out there. Uh, being the 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 trails were were nice and uh, firm. Not too, not too muddy today, um, but work worked well. One thing to, to remember, as you know, in these these studs on the pedals, they can they can uh, they can get you a little bit. I got uh, you can see I got got a little scratch there, but it seems like every time I ride, I get one of those things on my heels or my calves or on my uh, my shin or my calves. So uh, anyway, but everything did work well. The front tire worked well. The the front brakes they they work great. Uh, the shocks, the front shocks uh, being open, they they work well. As I mentioned yesterday, locking them, uh, you get to get to ride. Uh, it's almost like my road bike. The uh, the shifters seem to work well. I might have to adjust the the back uh, cassette, a, the the back uh, derailleur a little bit. But uh, other than that, it's it's it was just only on a couple gears, and then I didn't hear it anymore after that. So overall everything uh, seemed to work well uh the dropper seat post uh that that was that was great um i, I you can adjust it at various heights for you uh, you can have it extended all the way for riding on the the road or up hills and uh you can drop it fairly easy real easy to to do the tra trails and the jumps i did a a couple manuals yesterday and uh, a few little bunny hops off the curbs in the in the uh in the yard yesterday yesterday and today the same thing uh, you drop the, the the dropper seat and uh, you have full movement to move your move your uh, your body to the to the back end of the bike easy it works great as any of y'all know that as with the dropper seat so uh, the back shock the back shock uh, took everything that I needed needed on it I don't think I I might have uh, ex no, I don't even think I bottomed out as you can see on my my ring here, the lowest ring, was maybe a, a half inch, a quarter inch down from the from the bottom. So, so that worked out well. Um, everything everything uh, seemed to to do better than I expected. On a lot of the chatter riding, the front uh, the front shock took everything. It was just it felt smooth to me. Uh, there were a couple big roots that just just easily easily just. Uh, worked right through them. I went up a couple hills and went over some roots on some steep inclines and pedaled right up over, you know, you can pull up a little bit over the, 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 uh, over the brutes and uh, that worked out really great. So anyway, well, let me know if there's any more questions you want me to ask. I got to go clean up the bike and try to make it look new again. And uh, I look forward to, to doing some more for you, doing some more rides for you. Uh, whatever you need. Uh, like I said, the overall experience is this is a great bike. It rides rides perfectly for, for me. And for a budget bike, you can't beat it. You just cannot beat the thing. So 
uh, I, I think it can compete with any of the others out there. Out there, and being about 30 pounds, so you could uh, you lose two or three pounds on another uh, another composite bike. To me, this is this is great. So, yeah, if you can uh, if you can uh, subscribe to the channel, you'll you'll get some more of these uh, videos. Just like I said, leave me any questions you need, uh, and I'll be glad to make a video or tell you about it. Thank you. Have a great one.